Mzanzi, this is African Farming Digital. Now, technology can help you progress and to increase productivity on your farm. However, not everybody has access to technology, especially small-scale farmers in the rural areas. So today, we're going to be discussing about why is it important to integrate technology on your farming practice. I'm not alone. I'm with Praveen from Lemang. Welcome, Praveen. Thank you very much. Good to be here, Tawi. So, Praveen, I want to know, why is it important for new era farmers to integrate technology and data into their businesses? So, I think what, what's important is for farmers not to confuse data and information. So, information's always been there. I mean, we've got, farmers are always keeping records in some form or the other, you know, whether it's rainfall, whether it's, you know, when, when's the windy season, you know, how to adjust to irrigation, etc. So, it's always been there. I think what's happening these days is, there's a lot more innovation in order to capture that information, turn it into meaningful data for farmers to be able to use. Uh, and, and that's the key differentiator is how do you turn all of that information into something useful. So why should actually farmers use technology to capture data and to make sure that their businesses are running properly? It's that age old thing of, you know, when you, when you keep things on pieces of paper and suddenly you can't find it, you know, how, oh, if somebody else needs to run your operation for you, how do they access that information? So in order to put that into some form of technology driven um, tool, will make it so much easier for you to run the operation seamlessly. So, you know, if you need to be away from the farm for, for whatever reason and somebody else needs to take over, or you're selling the farm for that matter, or very importantly, attracting an investor or financier onto the, onto the farm, you, you have access to all of that information where you can show this is a proper enterprise. All of this information is available. You know, it's not just me telling you that, but yeah, it's backed by reliable data and information that is stored. On, on some sort of tool. Talking about data and technology as a whole, you can't just willy-nilly implement it. There's a whole lot of things that you need to consider, which is algorithms, intellectual property, the list goes on. So how should a farmer keep up with this process? So it's important to talk to a service provider that you can build a relationship with, somebody that is able to speak your language, um, you know, able to provide you with the tools that are necessary for your farm. There are must-haves and there are nice-to-haves. So the key differentiator is determine what it is exactly that you want to use the technology for. Important things are soil moisture calculations, for example, you know, to understand when not to irrigate, when to irrigate. So those are the important things. And you know, there are, there are service providers that are willing to come and do an assessment for you, work with you partner with you on that journey to make sure that that technology is providing you the best possible value for money, but also it's improving your farming practices totally. Now you get some farmers, especially in the rural areas, where they look at technology as an enemy and they say, ah, these things are for them lungus. But what programs are there to make sure that they have access to technology? The, the service providers that are out there, they are building more and more technology to support the small scale farmer. Um, so, you know, they are bringing down prices, making it a lot more affordable. We're not quite there yet, but I think the journey is, is progressing quite well. But it's, it's always important to, to speak to the service providers to understand what type of technology is out there for your specific operation. And lastly, Praveen, I mean, looking at our country and our agricultural well, state, do you think that we are tech savvy or do we still have a long way to go? Uh, we, we certainly far down the journey of being tech savvy. Um, you know, just on a smartphone, the amount of information that, that's on a smartphone. And most of our farmers either have or have access to smartphone capability. So there's a lot of apps, there's a lot of functionality that, that's in a smartphone that can already be used. You know, and, and speaking to the correct service providers, they're able to get so much more benefit out of that. There's a lot of technology. There's a lot of agri-tech companies. There's a lot of fintech companies that are providing solutions. We've just got to be ready to adopt those technologies and make it happen for ourselves. Praveen, thank you so much for having a chat with us. You're very welcome, Tavi. Always a pleasure. Technology is a tool, so see it for what it is, because it can help you increase your productivity and profitability on your farm. Thank you so much for watching African Farming. And remember, we farm better together. Get your free copy of the African Farming magazine now at your nearest co-op and at africanfarming.com.
Get the necessary cover for you and your family in the event of unforeseen misfortune. The African Farming Protector Plan offers you comprehensive funeral cover for your entire family plus extended family at an affordable cost. Our product also offers benefits such as monthly discounts on groceries, discounted bus tickets, ambulance services, and trauma and assault assistance, to name a few. For more information on the African Farming Comprehensive Funeral Plan, SMS African Farming to 45269 and get the peace of mind you deserve.